Let's look around the world as well. More than 722,000 confirmed cases of coronavirus around the world. Remember, the number of cases in each country is also driven by the amount of testing they do. So sometimes it's a bit hard to compare the numbers between countries. But of the confirmed cases, the US is on 142,000. That's almost a fifth of all the world's cases, while Italy just shy of 100,000. In terms of deaths, we're almost at 34,000 across the world now. Italy leading that leaderboard, unfortunately, 10,779. There's one country I do want to show you as well, though, and it's a bit further down the list, and it's Turkey. 9,217 cases so far, so considerably less than the ones uh, that, that are currently dealing with this uh, outbreak most acutely. But what's interesting is the uh, speed at which it's got to where it is. This is a selection of the countries around the world. This one's the US, 142,000, growing extremely steeply at the moment. Turkey is all the way down here. Uh, what's concerning, though, is how fast they've got there. And we can see that if we look at the trajectories. We've changed the scale of this graph and we've shifted all the countries so that their outbreaks start at the same point. You'd much rather be a country like Singapore with a slower growth than a country like the US with a steeper growth. But this is Turkey. Turkey has got to 9,217 cases before any other country in the world. It's got the steepest current trajectory. That is a really big concern about the outbreak in that country.